Hi, in this video we're going to go over some uh, virtual machine shutdown and restart options using the command line. So I'm going to be using VirtualBox 7, by the way. So these commands will work for VirtualBox 6 for the most part. There's one that didn't seem to be an option until 7, so I'll show you that when we get to it. So I have my commands here. So first thing you need to do is you need to navigate to your installation directory where these where the VBox manage uh, command lives. So we'll just open a command prompt, do a CD, paste that in there, right click. Okay, so now we're in that directory. So if you want to see the listing of your VMs, you could do this command here, list VMs, shows their uh, name with their ID. And if you want to see your running VMs, so we only have one running, this one right here with its ID. So here's the commands we're going to be using. So if you want to start a VM, so let's say you have a VirtualBox, the manager is closed and you just want to start a VM without having to open it, you could use this command here. And if you want to start a VM headless, which means it's not going to open the console, just be running in the background, let's say you're managing it you know, over the network and you don't need to have a GUI, you could do this. And then here's a command we're going to use to properly shut down a VM. And here's a command to properly reboot a command. And then there's other options here. So if you just want to kill a VM, you could use power off. If you want to just reset, like you press the reset button, reset, pause without changing its state, resume a paused VM, and then save the uh, current state of the VM and stop it with the save state command. So we're not going to do all these. We're just going to do a couple of them here. So since this guy's running here, we're going to do the shutdown option here. So obviously I'm going to copy this here. So I'll put this in the description. Obviously don't copy this part of it because it's not going to work. Just copy from here. We'll paste it in there. Let me get to this console here. So you can see it's doing a proper shutdown. And like I said, if you wanted to force it, you would do a power off option. Okay, so that first machine is shut down. So now we're going to do the headless start. So let me close VirtualBox here so I can show you how that works. So VirtualBox is not running, so we're going to start the same VM without starting VirtualBox. Because so if we were to do the option here, it would start VirtualBox and start that VM. So this one's going to do that without starting VirtualBox. Okay, so now you can see the virtual machine is running, but VirtualBox is not. And if I open VirtualBox, you can see it's running and it's actually starting up right now. And then obviously I could open the console. Okay, so the VM's up and running, so that's pretty much it. Uh, you know, we could do a reboot if you want to see that real quick. Just like that. So the main commands you're probably going to want to use are the uh, start VM, maybe the headless. If you don't need the console running, you just want to maybe start it and maybe get, get to it later. And you could open up the um, VirtualBox Manager and then get to the console screen if you want. And then the uh, shutdown one with the ACI, ACPI power button and then the reboot option. And this one here was not in VirtualBox 6. It said it was not a recognized command for the reboot. So you only had the reset, which just does a you know a quick power button type reset, which is not the way you want to restart it. So not sure why this was not in 6 or if they had another thing, but I couldn't find another substitution for this in version 6. So this is new for version 7, at least for me. So like I said, I'll put these all in the description. And then you could use these two to see your uh, all your VMs and the running VMs and get the ID numbers if you don't want to use the virtual machine name and that type of thing. All right, thanks for watching and be sure to subscribe. Thank <music> you.